All right. Um, today I'm going to be showing you how to uh, use the tell raw command in command blocks. So this is a um, fairly complicated thing to do, but I'll show you how to use a tool to really simplify this process. All right. So we got this text that comes out of a command block using the tell raw command, and that is uh, this is a test. And as you can see, this is kind of gold. Well, it's supposed to be gold, but kind of looks yellow orangish and this is this is a test click me to get stone obviously this is different colors and you don't really need MC edit to do this click me to get stone I hover over it I see stone hashtag zero 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 one <laughs> it's, uh, it's just a uh, stone ID I can turn that on and off and then as soon as I click click me to get stone I get stone so yeah see this is the command this is really long, but it's, you know, it's under, s well, I'll show you how to do it uh, using a tool so, right now. So, um, here we'll uh, get to learn how to generate the tell raw command. So, you're going to do at p, which specifies a player, at p is closest player, at r is random player, at a is all players, text, this is a test test with a T colon space this can be whatever color you want gray and I'll just do gold bold extra click me to get stone yeah stone because that's the easiest item code so light purple bold italic whatever the hell you want click event this um, specifies what happens when you click the click me to get stone so I'm gonna run a command and this is going to be give um, give at p one one so that's like one stone because um, the first one this over here is the data value for stone so hover event show item and so it'd be curly bracket id colon one curly bracket and then you generate extra plus then you 